Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. For anyone that doesn't know me, my name is Gary. I'm a very proud father of the bride. And on behalf of myself and Donna, Ryan and his parents, Darren and Leanne and the rest of the family, I'd like to extend a warm welcome, express our gratitude for joining us on this fantastic day. So as I stand here today, I can't help but reflect on a beautiful journey my daughter Emily has taken, from the first time she wraps her little fingers around mine to the accomplished woman she has become. It's been an honour to witness her growth. Emily, your radiant love and happiness right in every room you step into. I'm so proud to call you my daughter. From the day she was born, 21st of July, 1995, when I see her coming to this world with big brown eyes, I fell in love all over again. Having 28 years to prepare for a father of bride speech for my daughter, I'm still standing here today speechless how beautiful she looks. I'm so proud of her and so happy for what she has found someone who loves her and treats her well and of all the things I've done in my lifetime, being your father and caring for you is by far my biggest achievement yet. I know a successful marriage is not about finding a person you can live with, but finding a person that you can't live without. And I know you've found it with each other. I know she'll be an amazing wife, I know that because if she's anything like a mum, she'll still be making you smile 50 years on from now. Now let me welcome our new son-in-law Ryan and his parents Dan and Le Darren and Leanne and our whole family here today. But the truth is you've been part of this family since the day we met you. You're truly the perfect match for Emily, your kindness, your sense of humour, and your unwavering love for Emily have brought me, both me and Donna, immediate joy. We are thrilled to officially welcome you into our family. Over the years, our instincts have proven to be correct. We do look at you more as a son than a son-in-law. So remember, if you ever need our support or help, we're always there for you, as well as Emily. We can see how much you love and adore Emily, and we can see me and Emily made your life complete. I know you have a caring and sensitive side and a good heart and a good sense of humour. But seriously, if, as you begin this new chapter together, my wish for you is always cherish and respect one another. Remember to communicate openly, be each other's biggest cheerleaders and embrace the journey that lies ahead. May your love continue to grow stronger with each passing day. Neither of you will be perfect, but you can be perfect together. You have good years and you'll have bad years, but if you have each other, that's all you'll need. Here's to the past for all that you have learned, and here's to the present for all that you share. And here's to the future for your hopes and dreams, your love and happiness, and all you look forward to together. May your lives be filled with abundance of love, laughter, and countless beautiful memories. To the newlyweds, Emily and Ryan. Upon these persons here present, I call upon these persons here present to witness that I, to witness that I, Emily Jasmine Rose Cook, Emily Jasmine Rose Cook, do take thee, do take thee, Ryan George John Briggs, Ryan George John Briggs, to be my lawful wedded husband, to be my lawful wedded husband. Ryan, as I take you to be my husband. Ryan, as I take you to be my husband. I promise to love you. I promise to love you. To honour and respect you. To honour and respect you. I will stand by you. I will stand by you. And be true to you always. And be true to you always. I will care for you. I will care for you. Laugh with you when you are happy. Laugh with you when you are happy. And comfort you when you are sad. And comfort you when you are sad. 
And whatever life may bring. And whatever life may bring. I will always love you. I will always love you. Good afternoon, everyone. On behalf of me and my stunning wife, we would like to thank you all for being here today. It means the world to us both to have all our amazing family and friends here with us on what is the best day of our lives. We are so lucky to be surrounded by you all who have cheered us on and supported us from the very beginning. And now as we enter the next chapter together, we're so grateful to know you're all part of the moment as well. have been together for almost 13 years now. I remember the first time we met at Dagenham Town Show. A few months after that, I asked to be your date for prom. Only as friends, not knowing that I would fall in love with you and that we would end up going as a couple. Our first date was a trip to the cinema on Orange Wednesdays, how romantic of me. For those of you that don't know, that is the day you get half price cinema tickets. <laughs> One of the most memorable moments from that date was when we was arguing because I was starving and just wanted a McDonald's. 13 years later, nothing has changed. Nearly 13 years later, we have made so many memories from cosy nights in on the sofa, buying our first home together, getting our little Bertie and all our great holidays. Em, you are beautiful, kind, funny, loving and caring. And I am the luckiest man in the world to get to call you my wife. Thank you for just being you, supporting me through the hard times and inspiring me to keep going and encouraging me in life to always do better. I know I don't always say it, but you truly are amazing and my world. I always knew you would look beautiful on our wedding day, but watching you walk down the aisle today truly took my breath away in a way I could never be prepared for. the beach under the stars in the Dominican Republic where I proposed to you was so special and now goes down as our second best day of our lives. I cannot wait to start our new chapter as husband and wife and to spend the rest of my life with you. We get one life, one short life and I'm so lucky I found my best friend and life partner at such a young age to enjoy it with. Some people never find their soulmate, let alone when you was 15 and I'm 16. I cannot wait to build our future together and have a family together. I promise to give you the best life I can possibly offer, provide you with a lifetime of happiness, adventure, laughter and love that you deserve. I cannot promise we won't argue, of course we will, it's us. But I can promise to always be there for you, support you and take care of you for the rest of my life. This is just the start of a happy life together, always and forever. Here's to growing old together, I love you. So Ryan and Emily, you have both made the declarations prescribed by law and you have made a solemn and binding contract with each other in the presence of your witnesses, guests, my colleague and myself. This is the first day of your new life together and we all really do hope the feelings of love that you have for each other will grow deeper and stronger throughout your marriage. Therefore, now gives me great pleasure to announce in our officially husband and wife you may kiss your beautiful bride. Oh. 